Though the 90 Day Fiancé franchise revolves around marriage, there have been many divorces and splits in the last nine years, some which were more shocking than others. Numerous international couples have made it down the aisle, though this doesn't mean they achieved their happily ever after. Instead, around half of the couples ended up splitting, though some of the splits could be predicted from the start. The 90 Day Fiancé franchise has a roughly 50-50 success rate when it comes to marriage. The cast members who do break up either split due to the pressures of international relationships, or because of more traditional reasons. Some international couples fail due to cultural issues, language barriers, homesickness, and stress from major life changes. However, more universal reasons have also ended relationships. For example, infidelity has played a role in the demise of numerous couples. On the other hand, plenty of 90-day fiancé couples realized they simply weren't meant to be. 10. Juliana Custodio Michael Yesen, Shocking. Juliana Custodio and Michael Yesen were one age gapped 90 day fiancé franchise romance that actually appeared to be successful. Michael's ex wife blessed the relationship and married the couple, while Juliana got along very well with their two children. The duo seemed happy together, and like they had formed the perfect patchwork family. However, their sudden split during the pandemic revealed the truth about their relationship. Juliana shared that she was mistreated in her marriage and that she felt chronically used. On the other hand, Michael accused her of cheating on him. Juliana moved on quickly from the divorce and is now remarried and a mother. 9. Wife Ariano Muhammad Abdelhaim, not shocking. On the other hand, wife Ariano and Mohamed Abdelhaim are a couple who had an age-gapped relationship that seemed absolutely doomed from the start. When wife wanted to take the time to plan her dream wedding, Mohamed threatened to find a different sponsor to secure his place in the United States. Viewers were stunned that wife could marry him after this threat. Therefore, it wasn't a surprise at all when the couple split by the time of the tell-all. Muhammad was revealed to have cheated on wife, as his true intention seemed to be to come to the United States. 8. Tanya Maduro Singen Colchester, shocking. Tanya Maduro and Singen Colchester were never a perfect couple, though they seemed to suit each other. Tanya admitted from the start that Singen wasn't her soulmate, which didn't make their split surprising. However, the messy 90-day fiancé duo both said they loved each other when they decided to break up. Ultimately, they both realized that they weren't compatible after all. This bittersweet ending was a sad surprise, though Singen was later accused of mistreating both Tanya and his ex after her. 7. Tiffany Franco Ronald Smith, not shocking. Tiffany Franco and Ronald Smith from 90 Day Fiancé. The other way were messy in the wrong ways. From early on in the relationship, it was clear that things weren't going to work out. The only surprising part about the relationship is the number of times that Tiffany has come back to Ronald. Tiffany has slammed the father of her daughter and pointed out his many flaws on camera and online on numerous occasions. However, she periodically takes him back. Ronald now seems to be with his on-again, off-again girlfriend. 6. Chantel Everett Pedro Jimeno, shocking. Chantel Everett and Pedro Jimeno once had the title of a 90-day fiancé franchise golden couple. They started together on their spin-off show The Family Chantel, where they frequently had drama with each other's families, 
though they seldom had drama with themselves. The divorce between Chantel and Pedro was jarring due to how happy they seemed to be after the family Chantel season 3. However, their marriage was already almost over by the family Chantel season 4. It's unclear what made Pedro turn on his wife, which made their split feel sudden and out of character. 5. Nicole Jimeno Alejandro Padron, not shocking. While Pedro and Chantel's split was surprising, the one between his little sister Nicole Jimeno and her boyfriend Alejandro Padron shocked no one. Alejandro was married when he started dating Nicole, which was a good indicator that things wouldn't last. He also was at odds with her older brother Pedro, who couldn't stand him. Nicole and Alejandro split several times before it stuck. She then denied his attempts to rekindle their lost romance. For Evelyn Cormier David Bosca's Zermeno. Shocking, 90 Day Fiancé Season 5 couple Evelyn Cormier and David Bosca's Zermeno weren't popular. Because of this, they also didn't make any headlines for drama. Evelyn was very young when she married David, though she was very sure about the relationship. She infamously made her friend feel bad for not being in love. The couple then stayed out of the spotlight, except for Evelyn pursuing her singing career. That made their divorce seem shocking, as the news came out of nowhere. 3. Nicole Nafziger Azan Tefu, not shocking. The split between notorious 90-day fiancé couple Nicole Nafziger and Azan Tefu shocked absolutely no one, except for perhaps Nicole. Azan and Nicole are one of the messiest franchise couples of all time. Their entire relationship was plagued by chaos and incompatibility. Unlike their fellow 90-day fiancé season 5 couple Evelyn and David, things between Azan and Nicole were never stable and always heading towards them splitting up. The only surprise was that they split before tying the knot. To Molly Hopkins Kelly Brown, shocking. Molly Hopkins and Kelly Brown had a surprising 90 Day Fiancé franchise split after they met on 90 Day. The single life and fell in love. Kelly blended seamlessly into Molly's family and seemed to get along great with her two daughters. However, they split at the same time that Molly had a falling out with her best friend, Cynthia Decker. This led to a shocking amount of drama being revealed about Molly and her family, including allegations from both Cynthia and Kelly, and messy fights with her eldest daughter Olivia Hopkins. 1. Molly Hopkins Luis Mendez, not shocking. While the split between Molly and Kelly was surprising, the breakup between Molly and Luis Mendez didn't surprise 90 Day Fiancé viewers. Luis and Molly were wildly incompatible and often engaged in screaming matches. Furthermore, Luis made her daughters feel uncomfortable. It was clear that Luis was using Molly to get to the United States, as he moved in with another woman, and married her quickly after his split from Molly. Molly seemed to be the only person who thought her relationship with the younger man would last on 90 Day Fiancé. Let